Coming up this week on LMTV at Excelsior. If you enjoy plants or animals, we have a cool idea for you. We'll have the latest from the student store. And you've heard of distracted driving. We look at distracted eating in our Blue Zone update. Get ready. LMTV at Excelsior is next. This is LMTV. Linmar Television. Excelsior. Your news starts now. Welcome to LMTV at Excelsior. I'm Peter. And I'm Addie. Time now for today's top story. There are a lot of cool people here at Excelsior. LMTV's Eve joins us with a special guest. Eve? Joining me here is Sam, a seventh grader here at Excelsior. He's originally from the Congo. Welcome to LMTV. Thank you. Tell us some of the big differences between here and the Congo. Well, the president here in, in the U.S., they give four terms being president, but in the Congo, it doesn't really matter. We have one that was, that I have 36 power of um, being the president. Wow. What was one thing you thought was really different about Iowa? Well, the big thing I thought was Iowa, you get to get free food at school, but Congo, you need to bring your own one to get um, <laughs> food. Sam, thanks again for stopping by. Back to you. Thanks, Eve. Shopping at the student store is a privilege. Treat the store with respect and it will be around for a long time to come. Here's today's PBIS Point of Information Minute. When visiting the student store, it is important you have written your name on the back of your PBIS card. PBIS cards with no names will not be accepted at the student store. Remember, only one kind of candy is sold each day the student store is open. Tuesdays you may purchase gum. Wednesdays you may purchase Starburst, Thursdays you may purchase Dolly Ranchers. Only five pieces of candy may be purchased each day. Please make sure all wrappers are thrown out in the trash can and not thrown on the floor. Finally, be patient when waiting your turn to purchase items at the student store. Thanks for your attention to this week's PBIS Point of Information Minute. Thanks guys. Eighth graders, registration for high school classes is coming up soon. Today we take a look at classes in the high school agri-science department. LMTV's Kiki has that story. If you like growing things or working with animals, agri-science classes might be right for you. Take a look. Class registration will be coming up soon, so consider agri-science. Back to you. Thanks, Kiki. Speaking of high school. Eighth grade girls, we have an idea for you. Time is running out. If you are thinking about playing softball this summer, please sign up in the office soon so that you can receive information about the season. Back to you. Want to wrestle? Elm TV's Adarsh and Isaac have that story. If you are interested in wrestling, please sign up in the office. Practice will begin Monday, January 23rd at Oak Ridge. A shuttle bus will transport you to practice, and your guide can pick you up at Oak Ridge. Back to you. Thanks, guys. Cross-district bragging rights are on the line. LMTV's Addie has that and more in the LMTV Excelsior Sports Report. In the wide world of Excelsior Sports, today 7th grade girls basketball hosts Oak Ridge here at 345 while the 8th graders play there. Thursday, girls basketball faces Regis. 7th graders are there, the 8th graders play here. Also Thursday, boys swimming travels to Kennedy to face Harding, LaSalle, and Regis. I'm Addie, that's this week's Excelsior Sports Report. Avoid eating in front of the TV or while you're busy with other activities. It is easy to lose track of how much you are eating if you e eat while doing other things. I'm Kiana. And I'm Brianna with this week's Blue Zone Update. 
I'm Trey. And I'm Addie. Here's what the lunch crew is cooking up this week here at Celsius. Today, it's a flatbread chicken fajita. The beef nachos will tempt your taste buds on Wednesday. Thursday, it's a sloppy joe sandwich. And a fish sandwich is featured on Friday. That's lunch this week here at Excelsior. That's a wrap for this week's edition of LMTV at Excelsior. On behalf of the entire casting crew, thanks for watching. See you next week.